What's going on guys and girls? In today's video, I'll be doing a more informational video on whether or not AI content can actually rank on Google because this is the number one question that I always get from people every single day asking me whether or not AI content will rank, especially after the Google update. And if you can actually get AdSense approved websites using AI content. And I truly believe that AI content will rank on Google. I've done it myself, I've done it for clients, and I see multiple examples of people ranking AI content on Google. But if you wanna rank AI content, there's a couple of different things that you need to focus on. So number one is writing high quality AI assisted articles. So let's say for example, I wanted to go after the keyword, famous lawyers with low LSAT scores, right? We can see that this is a fairly decent keyword to go after, but instead of just going on ChatGPT and telling it, hey, um, write me an article on this topic, I'm pasting in the keyword, right? Instead of me going ahead and doing this, I'm pasting in the keyword. This article will be fairly low quality because I haven't prompted the AI. I haven't told the AI which website I'm writing for. I haven't told the AI what audience I'm writing for. I haven't told the AI, you know, what information to include. I haven't told the AI to include lists, tables, or formatted in an SEO optimized way. So this is going to be a very, very, um, a very, basic article. I go over a lot of advanced strategies within um, this YouTube channel of how you can write more high quality content. So I'll link a couple of those videos in the description below. I also have a full course on school.com, which is only $10 per month. And you can go over all of my in-depth strategies that's actually not on YouTube. And you can see how to write the best, highest quality content using ChatGPT or using Claude or even using Gemini, which is the new AI writer from Google. So you can't just necessarily go ahead and write surface level information because you won't be able to rank. So for example, this um, keyword I rank for, and I'll show you guys what the article looks like. As you can see, it's a really high quality article. There's internal and external links. We also have a table and we answer the question really good. It's an in-depth article. I believe we have some FAQs as well, and it's SEO optimized. So if you want to rank content, you need to be able to write in-depth, high quality AI assisted articles. So again, for example, for this website, which is a mortgage company in Canada, we created an article on the 12th. And as you can see here, this is a pretty in-depth article. I believe it's about, you know, 1400 words. And again, we can see that this article is ranking number six on Google and it's AI generated. So AI generated content does work, but you need to prime the AI, you need to prompt the AI in the right way. And you need to include lists and tables and also SEO optimize your content so that you're increasing the likeness that you actually rank on Google for that keyword. So that's the first thing in which you need to focus on. Number two ties into the keyword research, which is you need to write on keywords that you can actually rank for. It doesn't matter if you write the best article um, using a human compared to an AI generated tool. If you're writing on keywords that you actually can't rank for, if you're a new website, you should know that you need to write on keywords that are actually within the wheelhouse for what you can rank for. So if you do not have a high domain authority, then you should be writing on low keyword difficulty keywords. So if you're not doing the proper keyword research, it doesn't matter how you write the content, you will not be able to rank for um, that specific keyword. So again, for example, we can see that this is a fairly new website. And for the keywords, which I'm ranking for, they're all within zero to 12 or 14 keyword difficulty. They're not high, um, high keyword difficulty keywords because I naturally wouldn't be able to rank for that. And even if I am ranking for those keywords, as you can see, I'm ranking really, really far in the SERPs and I probably won't get any traffic from that, at least for now. So you need to focus on writing low and finding low competition keywords in which you can write after. So that's number two. And number three is that you need to create a lot of articles. You know, I get people telling me that they've created 20 articles and nothing's ranking on Google. You need to go out and create at least 100 articles. If you really want to test, create at least 100 articles for your niche using AI assisted methods that I show you. And you should be able to start ranking for keywords. You know, you're not going to rank if you have 20 posts and if you're you know, posting 10 one week and then the next four weeks you're posting another 10, it's going to be really hard for you to rank and grow a website. So you need to create a lot of content quickly and you need to continually create content for your website. Creating content right now is fairly cheap and it takes, you know, not a lot of time as it used to, especially when you use the methods that I show you. So if you're not ranking, then maybe you haven't created enough content. So I would recommend creating a lot more content and then you'll have more uh, information in which you can make decisions based on because you can see which type of content is ranking. You can see what type of articles are ranking and then that can allow you to create um, articles using information that you know will actually rank 
um, from your own website. So that is number three. And number four is that you need to build authority. I see a lot of people talking about ranking on Google, writing content using AI writers, but no one really talks about building backlinks. And this is a very, very, very important part of um, building your website. If you want to grow your website, you need to also be able to build your backlink authority. So that means you need to find creative methods in which you can build backlinks. And again, I have a lot of tutorials on this channel already, so you can check those out. They will be in the description below. But essentially, you need to be able to build backlinks because that allows you to now be able to target high competition keywords and keywords that you naturally may maybe wouldn't have been able to rank for but now you can rank for those keywords because you focus on building your backlink profile so not just only focus on creating a lot of content you also need to be able to build high quality backlinks and when you do that you're creating a real website you're creating a real website that's like a real business that's online not just a website that you're creating for the purpose of getting adsense approval because google is very smart so they know that the tactics that most people will take if they want to just get AdSense or make some money from a site, they would just create a lot of content, not worry about backlinks, not worry about building authority. And that used to work a couple of years ago, but it doesn't work today. So I hope that you guys enjoyed these few tips in which you can use to be able to increase the likeliness that your AI content will actually rank on Google. And then all you have to do is just rinse and repeat this process. And I guarantee you that you will be able to start ranking for keywords. And if you have some patience, and you continue to create content, you should be able to grow your website and monetize it. So again, if you enjoyed today's video, let it be known by giving us a big thumbs up. Also, if you'd like to try my new AI writer for completely free, I will leave a link for it in the description below today's video. You can use it to write quality content very, very easy using AI.